we're here in uh, Balala. This is the clinic that the government built. They haven't finished it yet. It's been two years. They keep promising that they're going to finish it. And they, they, I mean, you can see the state that it's in. The walls have not been plastered. There's no ceiling. There is a roof, but it leaks, and there's no floor. Um, this is actually, I stopped in here um, because this is the midwife's room, um, the place where they can uh, give birth to babies. And, and actually, they can't use it, and you can imagine why. Um, it's, it's not safe. It's not clean. Um, like I said, the roof leaks. It's actually rotting uh, because of the bugs, so all the wood is rotting away. Um, the government provided them with medicine that was expired from another town. They delivered it here. Um, the mobile clinic stopped coming because the people can't pay, and it's been a long time since they've had help. So it would be a, a tremendous help to these people to have the clinic finished um, and even to bring out some trained physicians or nurses that could help assist on things. Um, anyway, it, it was a, <laughs> sorry, it was a, a long night, and uh, we had a great meeting this morning. These people have a real need, and we'd love to help them out. So we're now in the, uh, the medicine storage room in the clinic. Um, all of the medicine is here. You can see in the boxes. They've got tons of medicine. There's only one problem. It's completely expired and ruined. Um, he just, he's got a box here of malaria medicine that's sealed up, but it's so far expired that it's useless. Uh, when we came into this room, uh, we actually saw rats start scurrying up into the ceiling. So the rats are eating the medicine, I guess. Um, anyway, uh, really, uh, really tough situation when they got, you know, some of the help from the government, well, all the help they got from the government to start the building, uh, but it's been two years and they've got nothing to finish it.